Today is November 13th, and as usual, I'll take a look at the newest items in Halo Infinite Store and determine whether or not they're worth your money. So to go Magpies, I'm Magpie Leon, and let's jump straight in. Today we have another returning bundle from Season 1, and that is the Fire and Frost bundle, aka the one that gives you the Iron Man coatings. This bundle contains 11 items and costs 1,200 credits. Luckily, it's returned for its reduced price, rather than its original price of 2,000 credits. However, for what it contains, I still think 1.2k is just a little bit much. Anyway, in this bundle, you get the Vermilion Fire Armor coating for the Mark 7 core, the Vermilion Flame coating for the Yori core, and the Vermilion Wrath coating for the Mark 5B. You also get the Snow Whisper weapon coating for the Battle Rifle, the Veerglass Memory coating for the Sniper, and you also get Veerglass Memory for the Bulldog. You also get the Trash Removal Stance, which has your Spartan standing there with the Bulldog, and you also get the A Tempest of Blades nameplate, armor emblem, vehicle emblem, and weapon emblem. As a whole, although there's a solid amount of content in this bundle, I do think 1.2k is still a bit much. I think maybe 800 to 1000 credits would be a much better deal. Obviously, you do get the coating for every core, and there is three weapon coatings here, but compared to bundles that give you actual armor, again, this costs the same price as actual armor sets, which tend to give you helmets, shoulders, chest pieces, etc. I do like the Iron Man coatings and they are somewhat tempting, I really like how it looks on my Mark V B core right now too. The Snow Whisper coating for the Battle Rifle is fine, but I am a big fan of the Veerglass Memory one as it sort of looks like your weapons have been frozen. Whether or not I'll get this one, I'm not entirely sure, but let me know down in the comments if you'll be picking up this bundle. Thank you all for watching and I'll catch you all in the next one.